Number 25, Julian Diller. She was the sole survivor of Lansa Flight 508 that came apart midair over the Peruvian rainforest after being struck by lightning. Julianne fell thousands of feet still strapped into her chair, but her fall was cushioned by the jungle canopy and she survived with only a broken collarbone. Luckily, there was a stream nearby and after following it for nine days, she was rescued by loggers. Number 24, Nando Parado and crew. After a Uruguayan rugby team crashed high into the Andes Mountains, the survivors resorted to cannibalism. One of the survivors, Nando Parado, managed to devise a way to climb over the 17,000 foot peak that had the group trapped on a glacier. They then marched 10 days until being rescued. Number 23, Stephen Callahan. Setting sail from the Canary Islands towards the Caribbean in a small sailboat, Stephen's boat sank in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean and he was left adrift for 76 days. He eventually made landfall in the Bahamas. Number 22, John Coulter. An American trapper, he was captured by Blackfeet Indians in 1808. After stripping him naked and telling him to run, Coulter realized that he was the object of a human hunt. He managed to elude and even kill some of his pursuers while making his way towards Fort Raymond, nearly 200 miles away. Number 21. Ernest Shackleton's Expedition Team When Sir Ernest Shackleton was on his way to cross Antarctica on foot, his ship got stuck in the ice and with no outside help they remained stranded for 22 months. For the first year, the crew lived inside the ship, but after the ice destroyed it, they moved out onto the ice. Ernest eventually made the decision to sail 800 miles in a lifeboat to South Georgia Island, where there was a small whaling operation. Number 20, Aaron Ralston. Aaron's story was highly publicized in 2003 when he had to cut off his right arm in order to free himself from between a boulder and a rock wall. He had been hiking in Utah when the boulder shifted and pinned his arm. Number 19, Pierre Viaud. In 1766, Pierre was aboard a French merchant ship that wrecked in a storm off the coast of Florida. He struggled to find food and shelter in the Florida swamps and even killed his own slave so that the slave wouldn't have to die of starvation. Eventually, though, he was rescued. Number 18. Debbie Kiley In October of 1982, Deborah and four others set out in a yacht from Maine to Florida. After high seas off the coast of North Carolina destroyed the boat, they were left adrift in shark-filled waters. One of them swam off and was never seen again, and another was eaten by sharks directly beneath the raft. Only Deborah and another crew member survived. Number 17. The Gremlin Special Passengers On May 13, 1945, a U.S. military plane nicknamed the Gremlin Special crashed into a mountain in Dutch New Guinea. Three of the passengers survived only to find themselves surrounded by a tribe of known cannibals. Lucky for them, the tribe mostly only ate enemy tribesmen. The trio was eventually rescued. Number 16, the whale ship Essex crew. After being rammed and sunk by a sperm whale, the 21 sailors from the Essex were set adrift. Resorting to cannibalism and drinking urine, they eventually made it to a deserted island with few resources. They separated to find help and some returned to the ocean in their boats. Only eight survived. Number 15, Jan Balsrud. In March 1943, Jan and a group of expatriate commandos arrived in Nazi-occupied Norway from England. Their goal was to aid in the resistance. After the mission fell apart, Jan was pursued through the Norwegian tundra with almost no clothes and a bullet wound. He eventually found a friendly Arctic village that helped him escape back to England. Number 14. Abby Sunderland While attempting to become the youngest person to sail solo around the world, the mast of Abby's 40-foot yacht snapped about 2,000 miles from land in the middle of the Indian Ocean. She was rescued by fishermen two days after raising a distress signal. Number 13. Hugh Glass. After being mauled by a bear during a fur trapping expedition in Missouri, the expedition leader asked some men to stay back with Hugh until he died and then bury him. The men, however, left while he was still alive and reported him as dead. When Hugh regained consciousness, he crawled to the Missouri River and then made his way to Fort Knox on a raft. Along the way, natives helped him by sewing bear skins over his festering wounds. Number 12. Beck Weathers. Documenting the deadliest season in the history of climbing Mount Everest, the bestseller Into Thin Air tells the story of Beck Weathers, who miraculously survived losing consciousness high in the death zone. After spending 18 hours in the sub-zero temperatures, he regained his senses and stumbled back to camp. His face was badly disfigured and he lost both hands. Number 11. The Donner Party this group of American pioneers was trying to make it to California when a series of mishaps forced them to spend the winter of 1846 in the Sierra Nevada mountains. 
Some members of the party resorted to cannibalism to survive, and in the end, 48 of the original 87 members made it. Number 10. Lieutenant David Steves When he was supposed to fly from California to Alabama, Lieutenant David Steves never arrived. A search turned up nothing and he was declared dead. Two weeks later, however, he came walking out of the Sierra Nevada mountains after ejecting when something blew up in the jet. Number 9. The Balloon Crash In the winter of 1920, three U.S. Navy lieutenants crashed a hydrogen balloon deep in the Canadian wilderness. They hiked for a week until they finally reached a trading post on Hudson Bay. Number 8. Yossi Ginsberg In 1982, Yossi and three friends got lost in the Bolivian Amazon. The party broke into pairs and two were never seen again. Yossi and his friend built a raft to float down river but got separated in the rapids. His friend was rescued and Yossi was found 19 days later wandering the riverbank. Number 7. Hiru Onoda A former Japanese intelligence officer who fought in World War II, Hiru did not surrender until 1974. In fact, he spent almost 30 years holding out in the jungles of the Philippines because he refused to believe that World War II had ended. Number 6. Captain James Riley In 1815, American Captain James Riley and his crew were shipwrecked on the coast of northern Africa. They were captured and sold into slavery, which led to an insane journey through the heart of the Sahara Desert. Eventually, they were freed by a sympathetic British merchant. Number 5. The Lewis and Clark Expedition Dispatched by Thomas Jefferson to explore the West, the expedition was robbed, injured, and nearly starved to death numerous times. Without the help of friendly native tribes or their translator, Sacagawea, they would have surely died. Number 4. The Robertson Family 200 miles off the Galapagos Islands, a pot of killer whales rammed and destroyed the Robertson family's ship. The parents, three children, and a friend were adrift for 36 days until being rescued by a Japanese fishing trawler. Number 3. John McCain After his plane crash during the Vietnam War, Lt. John McCain was captured and tortured repeatedly for nearly five years until he was finally released. He even turned down an early release offer on one occasion, saying that unless every other prisoner that came after him was released, he wouldn't leave. Number 2. Steve Fawcett Two-thirds of the way to successfully circumnavigating the globe solo in a helium balloon, Steve tried to fly over a storm above the Coral Sea. At 30,000 feet, hail shredded his balloon and his passenger capsule started falling towards the ocean. Amazingly, he survived and was rescued 10 hours later. And number one, Slavomir Rawitz. After being sentenced to 25 years in a Siberian gulag, this Polish officer along with six others escaped the camp in Yakutsk and marched 4,000 miles on foot across the frozen Siberian tundra, the Gobi Desert, through Tibet and over the Himalayas to British India. If you liked the video you just saw, then consider clicking on the button at the top right to subscribe. Also, check out our other popular videos, 25 Most Ridiculous Questions on Yahoo Answers, and 25 Strangest Things Banned by Governments Around the World. If you're still itching for more, go ahead and check out our website at list25.com for a whole bunch of cool lists.